here's the situation. Today, I'm being taken out to this place, which I've been told is the embodiment of corruption in this country. It's censoring Ukraine. That definitely means something. But then on the positive note- Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Stone them, go them. <laughs> Positive note, we're going out to this new uh, facility. It's a $200 million project for the future and the youth. I'm excited to be back. Okay, here we go. snowy day it's freezing actually yeah man so are we making snowmen are you are you, are you excited me? about today I am because I don't necessarily uh, know what I'm getting into yeah. we're going to Unikovich residence Mezhigorya the former president yeah okay. and you're gonna see how lavish and insane it was to his home and why Ukraine is changing for the better because of that it's gonna be amazing let's do it What's, what's this story here with this wall, this uh, big green barrier? I guess because of, you know, all the other residents of this area, he just wanted to separate himself from the outer world. And that is why all the security on the very entrance and double gates here and there. But uh, uh, Donald Trump would definitely be jealous of oh, this one, right? Oh, he would approve, like, I guess. <laughs> I used to study in, uh, in a technical university, but then I realized that technical education and especially IT uh -huh. in Ukraine, where computers and floppy disks are older than myself. Mm -hmm. You saw the floppy disk and you said, this isn't for me? Or what, I just what realized the, uh... that if I, like, I had to spend four more years in this institution and I encounter such old, almost reliquary technology. Sure. I'm just afraid what I'm going to encounter next, you know. So this is the man, I guess, that watches over the home. I think he lives here. Did he say he lives here? He does. Yeah. He never left. I have more time than Yanukovych than Yanukovych. Spent here more times than Yanukovych did. <laughs> wow. Yanukovych <laughs> must have a real love for uh, Petro. So it used to be silver, mm -hmm. but then he didn't like it. This is why you had floppy disks. At maybe. Your, at your yeah, school. yeah, yeah, maybe. That is the reason. Let's say I'm down with the guy's yeah. style, but the craftsmanship is spectacular. Yeah. Like all it, the it is indeed. He oh, he controlled all the way to Chernobyl. He, he wanted to. Oh, he, he wanted, wanted to. to. 17 types of wood just on the floor. This is all separate, like... Yes, yes, separate small pieces of wood. It was constructed during three years. Oh, it was, you know... It's golden on the end. With too. crystals. <laughs> God. <laughs> just insane. I've always 
My God. I've always dreamed of a uh, dead alligator on my table. Look at that. This seems too extreme for it me. It seems like a good investment seriously. in the uh, in the people. Oh, a little oh, church oh, situation. Seriously? Seriously? A church? Right, of course. Amber gold, amber silver. The icon is written by Ivano-Francisco. It's hard to tell actually what he believed in because all of this. I think he believes in money. Yeah, would you, quite, would you quite say possibly. <laughs> <laughs> this is way too extreme, you know. <laughs> wow. The old hoarding, take all, steal from the people mentality, that is the right? Yeah, it is. I don't think Ukraine content. is going to stay in the state for long, honestly. Just because to support all this. You need to take this influence, this money, this power from somewhere. Right, 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 right. And people are not given, are not willing to give it anymore, because we're building our, our own future, and it doesn't look like this. Words are nothing, actions are everything, right? As we see so with, true. with all this, yes, right? So true. So your action of not getting on that plane <laughs> and going to the U.S. when you have a visa and a couple and of staying here yeah. says something. <laughs> I thought it was crazy. That's why he likes me. Fist pump. Petro. Yabronos. Okay. There's definitely more to that story. Uh, but wow. Okay. We got more. Here we go. Are you ready for us? I hope to inspire you and to give you a second picture of our country. Another picture. About one year and a half, uh -huh. it was a motorcycle factory, old one, mm -hmm. and it was renovated in nine months. Um, so that's just 2% of what we are going to build in the next 10 years. It will be 25 hectares of land dedicated to innovation mm -hmm. and technology. It will be city and the city with the business campuses, educational institutions, uh, infrastructure objects and also residential areas. Let's go inside. It smells like, um, like a lab. It smells like technology. It does. <laughs> this is how technology smells. What did Yanukovych's place smell like? Like morbid, like stale. Crusty old corruption? Kind of, yeah. Oh, like when you would just, you know, they see the chance, they take it, and if it's in your brain, if it's better, bigger, faster, stronger, why not? You know, it's the best choice on It can. sounded like some sort of, um, Fast food campaign. I like it. <laughs> I like it. Uh, that anyone can come here from Ukraine or yeah, the world yeah, yeah, or yeah. anywhere. And it's, it's like a uh, fund for Ukraine, for uh, Ukrainian technologies, and it's for all people uh, in our country uh, to inspire them. It's a uh, like place for inspiring them to do something new here, here in my country. And do you, you don't do any ceremony here at the, in this no. space right here? Okay, good, <laughs> no. good, good. No. There's no special oath? No. Okay. All my life I'm in education. If you're still thinking, if you still have interest, if you're still learning uh -huh. and searching information, you could be accepted. Where this to me is an example of, I don't know much of the backstory about who funded this, um, mm -hmm. but He's putting his money in, obviously, to something that's generating thought, creativity, and, and skills, and skills, it's and this free. is free, whoa. It's your English is amazing. Thank you. You, you <laughs> saw a lot of YouTube, obviously. Yeah. And with your really bad jokes, I've heard in the last <laughs> few days, it's obvious you saw a lot of, 
<laughs> you too. But uh, you're connecting that. You're you're finding the, the super good talent, and then you're the English guy that can like fuse the yes. skills together. Yanukovych's house to here. Tell me that. Tell me that transition. It's just dead water. It's so scary to go there. It was scary to go out of there as well. But when you come here, you just feel the difference in energy. It feels the difference in how people communicate, how, right. how they walk, you know? Right, right. You just observe them, they behave differently. It's an openness, course, obviously. Sure. I'm not from here. But from first impressions, it needs more of these types of institutions, which allow smart people like you to flow into it Collaborate with like-minded people and then actually do something with the skills you get. Будущее Украины это ее люди. Самый большой потенциал, как в любой другой стране. И борьба будет вестись в положительном смысле этого слова за людей, за их головы, за то, чтобы вложить что-то умное, полезное в их головы и фактически получить от этого результат. Мозги самый дорогой ресурс, который будет сейчас на планете в ближайшее время. Everything in Ukraine, right? It's the yeah. bond. It's the bond. Like, it's boom here or boom here. Like Yanukovych's house is the complete opposite of it the is. spectrum, right? Like the service in this country. Yeah. It's the best or the worst. The people in this country seems to me like the best or the worst. It's very like, polar. The roads. <laughs> Once again. I don't know if there's any the best roads, yeah. but there's some good roads. Yeah. But there's some yeah. really shitty ones, right? And like. And it's hard to wrap your head around as a foreigner to go from that house to this place, yeah. Into this, right? Yeah. Yes. But the new way of the world, the way the world is going, any successful business model opens and lets things breathe in and out of it, right? Yeah. And that's understood here. It, it is. You can yeah. feel it here. Yeah, so true. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> it's been good. Thank you. All Thank right. you. I'm glad you were able to do All this. Right. the original question does Ukraine have a future and I do not have the magic ball I know it's a catchy title but uh, of course it has a future does it have a positive future well if you take the youth here that I've seen in Kyiv people like Ruslan that are educated motivated and driven and they have a place this is the crucial part they have a place where they can grow and flourish like what we just saw then yes Ukraine has a beautiful future to be continued.